Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to Crash Landing. It's Sticks here, and today I want to build the high oven. So that is just this thing here. So we're going to get all the bits and bobs together for that. We've got quite a few of them. I'm going to read through this and see how to make it, because there's uh, all the writing here. So um, to begin, we lay the three, a 3x3 three three bed of scorched bricks. Continue laying bricks in a similar fashion upward, but leave the center hollow. Cap it off with one additional 3x3 three three layer just like the bottom. Okay, so that's pretty easy. While there are no vertical limits to the size of your height oven, it is pointless to build it beyond eight blocks in height. Um, uh, okay, place the controller in the middle of any layer you desire. You may place drains anywhere within the structure. The controller must have an active redstone signal to burn fuel. Simply placing a lever anywhere next to or on the controller will do the trick. Okay, so for now, that's, that's what we're gonna build. We're gonna try building this. Um, I've got a couple of things. I've got some cracked scorch bricks. Now, I'm, I'm, I think we can hammer these to get bricks, normal bricks. So we've got our hammer here. Let's just see what happens when we hammer these freaks. Um, no. Okay, so I typed in scorched. Um, I typed it correctly, though. Not like that. Okay, scorched bricks, and then it told me I could put X Nilo hammer. Okay, liquid casting table. No, I want to turn the crumbling scorch bricks. Oh, crumbling. Is that not what I just put down? Crumbling? Oh, okay, these are different from what I just put down. Okay, so these are cracked. I don't think we can do anything about those. Man, we need we need new tools as well, guys. We, we might get onto that this episode. Some better tools. I've been researching the Tinker's Construct tools because I, really, uh, I don't really get that. I don't really understand. Okay, before I put any more of those down... Let's get rid of this. I don't know how to get rid of this This whole focus, focused thing on that. Oops. All the wrong buttons. Okay, there we go. Now we're getting bricks out of it. Oh, we didn't get any out of that one. Maybe we did. So crumbling. Okay, we got a lot more crumbling ones. So these crumbling. Okay, cool. We can get a lot more bricks, so we're going to be able to build this. I thought we were going to run out, but that is okay. So let me get some more. Oh, well, hello there, hole. Nice to meet you. Um, yeah, let me get all this stuff together. And then we will start working on that. Alrighty guys, so I don't know if I've told you my plan yet, but we are going to start building a proper building here. One from the ground upwards, you know, like a normal building. But anyway, this is going to be the center of the middle. Um, this is going to be the middle of the floor. So let's put all these together. Crumbling scorch bricks. Oh, I had more. Anyways, we've got enough now. So we need a 3x3. Three three. We're going to make this the middle of the floor. So we're going to go like this. Oops, we don't want that one there. And we're going to go there. We're going to go there, there. Oh my goodness, I've run out. Have I really run out? Okay, so we don't need, we need a duct. So we'll have the duct over here. And then uh, we put a casting basin down here, I think. And we need a seared tank like here. I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure that goes like that. And we need a high oven controller, which will go here. Um, no, maybe we need, did we put a scorch drain in here? Yeah, we did. No, it's scorch duct. What is a, what's the difference between that and a drain? What does a drain do? Let's put a drain around this side. Don't know the, what those the difference between those are. We can put a casting table here. I, I don't really know, guys. I'm kind of... I'm just winging it here, winging it completely. So we need a few more of those, which is good, because we got more crumbling scorch bricks. Let's get those out and get our pathetic silver hammer, which has almost died already. Look at the durability on it. I just made it because I had heaps of those. Oh, we get three more. That should help us finish. One. And what is this? We have clay. When did I get clay? I think I got it from a reward. I don't want that in there. Oh, this is frustrating. Let me get up here. Okay. Right, that's perfect. We have one more for the back here. High oven controller. Um, okay, so I think we're good on that. I think this will work now. Oh my goodness, this stuff takes forever to break. don't even know why it's in my inventory. Okay, so if we click on here, everything seems to be good. Do we put the fuel in here? I'm very confused. Let's quickly take a look in our book. Says we need one high oven controller and a faucet. Okay, so we need the faucet. 
and we need okay so I don't think we need that tank actually so we actually need some more scorch bricks damn it that is not cool I am not impressed where, where do these keep coming from didn't I just use these up I'm so confused please do all of these dumb hammer dumb stupid hammer okay it doesn't matter we got it now if I look at my inventory I better not have any more crumbling bricks no more? Okay, that was very confusing. Uh, there'll just be two of my inventory. Okay guys, let me see. This should be working now. We can put that up there. Okay, if I take this out... Oh no, it's still there. Okay, so I have no idea whether I've made this correct or not. But let's get a lever and the faucet and everything that we need. Alrighty guys, let's just fly down here really quickly. But while I'm doing that, I actually saw something the other day. Oh, I'm sure I put that back on in time. If you combine an apple with an oak tree sapling, you get an apple tree sapling. Like, how cool is that? Let's plant that beast. Then we're going to get apples and oranges. Then we can have apple juice as well. And I really like apple juice, so that's awesome. Okay, so I've got a lever. Um, got a whole lot of random stuff in my inventory. I had to get some more leaves. My water making thing had stopped. I think we can put this on here. No, like that. Yes, and now we put... A lever on the front here. We turn that on. Okay, so that's that's kind of working. We need a fuel. So now that we've got clay, let's get this clay down. Um, I want to pick this up. We need the clay. We need to make another. How many was that? Sixteen. That's not a lot. It's hard to get clay actually. I need to get more because we need another uh, one of these what are these called crucible we need another crucible so let me make one of those really quickly okay guys i got a few things together here let's see let's put in charcoal no into the fuel slot there we go burning heating up um, i'm pretty sure now we just need to put this in here and this is hopefully going to give us more i think we need to build the other the smeltery anyways I'm, I'm really not sure. I think this thing gives us more ores than... Like, if we put nine in there, we'll get more than nine out. I'm pretty sure that's what this does, so let's just see. Let's go get uh, some more charcoal, because that looks like it's going to run out fairly quickly. I love this little, uh, this little hang glider thing. It is totally awesome. Let's go up here. We're also making some lava over there, so... Let's get more of that. Chuck that in. All right. Oh, we can just fly down there. I keep forgetting that. It's a much funner way down. Yep, we're making lava in our little crucible right there. Made another one, so that's good. We got our apple tree going. And bloop, let's drop down. Okay, so let's see. We're going. We're melting all this. We're up to 142 degrees. Let's chuck in some more charcoal so we don't run out. Now, I guess it's doing all of it at once. I'm not entirely sure how much lava do we have in there. Not enough yet. Okay, so let's put another lever on this side. See, actually, I think I like them on the side, not up there. That looks a bit silly. So what does this thing do? What? We can't put the lever in there. Don't pick that out. That's just silly. Unbelievable. So yeah, we'll put these on the side. They look silly up there. And we're going to spell out bloop, bloop. Uh, we might put them away from the controller because I don't want it to turn that off. That would be very annoying. Okay, it is it is burning those things up nice and quickly. We got all nine of those done. If we keep this at quite a quite a heat, we might be able to um, get quite a bit done here. We get some more iron. We'll put that in afterwards. Come on, heat up, my friend. Okay, guys. So it's going faster and faster for each one. So we got two ingots from one. Okay, that is awesome because we're just about to finish that one. See how much we have now. We got four. Okay. So what we can do is come around to the casting table, I think, and we've got a pickaxe cast here. We put it in here, we can flick the switch, and that's not working. Okay, let's try this on the other side. I don't have my pickaxe with me. Can we pick these up like this? No, come here. I don't want that. Okay, let's go get our pickaxe. Just quickly, it's over here. It's in here. We'll stop this thing going. Um, stop. Go right-click it, you silly thing. Okay, let's get up here and put our pickaxe back where it's supposed to be 
Where is the pickaxe? There it is. It's almost broken. So we're making us cobblestone. Okay, so let's bring it around this side, because maybe this side works. I'm not sure entirely how these things work. No, we want a casting table. Let's put that here. Put the pickaxe head in. Flick this. And um, apparently that's not how you get it out, guys. I got eight ingots. So it's definitely giving it, it's giving us like two per one, which is, I thought it was meant to triple it, but you know. No, okay, maybe the lever's in the wrong place. Let's put the lever up the top. Okay, guys, I don't know. I don't know. Let me figure this out. Oh, guys, I did it by accident. I don't know how many ingots it took to make that, but we got an iron pickaxe head. So, what well, before we had the, the nickel, and I'm guessing you can't get the nickel out like that. So maybe we have to put in another one of those, uh, the drains, back here. So if we find a... We will have to make another drain. But um, yeah, okay, so we, now we have an iron pickaxe head. Okay, that's cool. That's that's awesome. I'm not sure how we're going to use that, but um, we've worked this thing out. And oh my goodness, this is up high. We can put the lead ore in next, then we'll get heaps of lead. But I don't want them to mix together, and I don't think they do in here. I'm pretty sure they don't. So, okay, so we have molten iron. What else can we do with that? Should we make a block? Let's make a whole block of it. No? Don't have enough for that? I want to put that in there. How much do we need for a whole block? We'd need 9, right? So how many do we have? We have 15. Poor you freak. Okay. What happens if we just pour it out here? Oh, it's because the strain was on, maybe? Let's try it now. No, okay, so the duct doesn't seem to work. The drain, however, does. Okay, so let's take this out. Let's put a casting basin here. Now it'll work. Okay, so this one here is for, obviously, why is it not filling that up? I'm very confused. Oh, we're overheating because we're near this thing and we've run out of water. Okay, we got heat stroke. Let's go get some water, guys. Okay, guys, finally, I think we have something working here. Stuff this. I'm going to make this later. We need this to make more of those and whatnot. And, uh, I don't really know what's going on, but this thing appears to be working. Are we almost out of water? Yes, we are. Okay, this thing here appears to be working. So I made an ingot cast. I actually have this thing over here half working. I have some gold in here, so I use that to make an ingot cast. You just put an ingot in there, and then you, you pull the cast out. But um, we won't... So let's see what we can put in here. We can put in... A whole heap of stuff I didn't bring down with me. So this thing will double ores. The other thing said it would triple, but it was only doubling, so I'm very confused. Um, right, if we go up here, we will go into here. What do we need? We need tin, lead, aluminium. Let's just do all of those. Let's go tin, and lead, and aluminium. I'm, I'm not sure what this is going to do. Hopefully they don't combine together, because that's going to make me sad. Let's just fly down over here. Okay. So let's just start with aluminium. Puts it all in the different spots like that. Starts cooking them. And then they will fill up in here. So um, how do we get up there? Let's just use this glass. Oh, they're in there. That's wicked. That's really cool. Okay, let's just put this as a staircase. And then that's all going to mount down. Man, we really need water. Into here, and then we can pull these levers and get the stuff out. So I'll show you guys in a second, but we really... Okay, that's really not giving us any food at all. Let's eat some rice, which also is not giving us very much food at all. I did take the time to make a whole lot of food, but we used it to go adventuring. Oh, and to get all those, I had to go back to the city. And that's why I have no water now. Oh my goodness, come on, faster, faster. Need to go faster. I need a thousand in there to get my water. Okay, we might have to come up with another machine to make water. Um, okay, so while that's going, let's go in here. Let's get all our saplings. So we have thousands of them. Okay, not thousands, but we have quite a few. I thought there was a couple in here. I might have moved them. Okay, they should all be in here realistically. Oak, spruce. Um, okay, now we can get some buckets of water out of these things, so I'll put them into the transposer down here. 
Let's shut the door. I found a creeper in here before. I was I was not impressed at all. Let's put all those in there and see what happens. Okay, that's going to fill that up. Cool. We'll come back to that soon and fill up our water buckets. Fill up our uh, thing, sorry. Oh, we still can't get any. Come on, we're dying here. 900. Okay. Okay, guys, we got some water. Oh, must have jumped completely. Right, now let's have a look in here. Let's see what we've got. Okay, so we've got the liquid in there. That's good. They all melted down. We got 32 ingots. We put 16 in. Okay, that's really awesome. So if we flick this switch, it's going to make an ingot right there. Pull that out, and we should have an iron ingot? Aluminium ingot. They look very similar. And then, yeah, we, every time we flick this, we'll just get a new one. And if you flick it now, it won't come out. So that's cool. But if I uh, put this over here, where did the lever go? Right there. Okay. We flick it here, it's going to fill up this basin. And we've got to do this 10 times to fully fill this thing up. And once it's fully filled, you see it keeps filling up slowly. It goes up one every time. I think it's 10 times anyway. It feels like 10 times. And now, now it's full. Give it a couple of seconds. And it will turn into a full block. There we go. We got a full aluminium block. So that is pretty cool. We're going to have to get a few more levers on here. And that uses a decent amount of lava. So um, let's get all of this out of here. Um, I'm going to set up an automatic system for holding um, the fluids over here. And we'll be able to get them out from these portable tanks. Um, I'm actually going to make these tanks hardened so that it can hold uh, more stuff for us. Okay guys, here we go. We have servos. We will put them in here and then we can uh, Then we just right click on it. Is that right? Oh, do we need an open hand? Yes, we do. Blacklist? No, whitelist. And then we want to put a fluid in here. So can we get um, This will be aluminium uh, Aluminium molten aluminium. No, I wanted to drag that into it. How do we put that in there. Oh my god. No, did we, there's no way we made that. What is in here? Molten aluminium. Yes, that's what I want to put in here. Okay, it's too hot here. I can't be here for too long, alright? Damn thing. Uh, okay, how do we put it in there? Do we get a glass of this stuff? Put it in there. Um, okay, open hand. Can we drag this in here? We can get that. Can we put it in inventory? <laughs> that would be awesome. Wait, does this work? No, okay, thank God for that. That would be awesome. Okay, um... Let me figure this out. Okay, guys, I have finally figured this out. We have to power this. Uh, if we have anything left in here, we can power this. Set this to output. And then it will come along and go into these. So what I want to do is add this one in now. And I want to put a servo in it, like so. Then we need to go open hand to open it. And in here, we're going to put what we want. So this one has molten lead. So only molten lead can go into that one. So let's go back over here. I'm going to run out of water. Let's put silver in the next one. So the silver's all cooked up. Let's do this. And you'll see it won't go into this one. It'll only go into this one. And I haven't put all these on because it separates them evenly if you haven't put servos in yet. So, yes, we're going to put it on whitelist so that only that thing can go through. But we need to get a bucket of it first. So, let's just do this a couple of thousand times. If you just spam it, it works too. Okay, let's do that one more time. Let's see how much we got in here. We got over a thousand. Okay, cool. Is the bucket. Pick the bucket up, open hand, click in there with that, and then you've got it. And then we can chuck it straight back in. So now when we click on here, only molten silver will go in here. So we can do that again. And that will fill up even more. Okay, cool. So this is the molten, molten aluminium, I think. There's some still left in here. No, there isn't. Okay. Um, what are we going to put in? Let's put in the tin ore. 
That's going good. We're going to run out of fuel fairly quickly. I'm going to make a a machine over here that creates lava. Oh wow, you can see all the stuff from here. That's really cool. Oh, you can't see it from up here. But yeah, okay, so that is cool. <clears throat> My voice just destroyed itself. Um, and yeah, if we want to make this still be like that, we can do this and create a whole ingot. But for now, I'm going to do this, and I'm going to set up um, the majority of these. I'm probably going to have to get more, actually. Now that I think about it, there's more ores than this. Alrighty, guys, so that is about it for today. That is what we've got going here. I'm going to set all of these up. Um, I haven't got enough for this one, so there'll be another two types of things going in here, hopefully. Um, my thing is a little bit full at the moment, so I'm going to make a whole lot of um, ingots and whatnot. We have 46 silver ingots and 80 tin and 24 lead, and I know there's some more stuff around. This is crazy. What do we want? This We want this platinum at the moment. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like and subscribe if you haven't yet. There's heaps more stuff on my channel. And there's uh, normal Minecraft uh, Let's Plays as well, so and also tutorials. So yeah, thank you guys. See you guys on the next episode.